Hello people, welcome to one of my most anticipated games of 2011. It's Portal 2, which has just been released and I'm ready to do an LP of it. So let's start this game. for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. It's a better room than the first one in Portal. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will yeah. hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. Yes, I'm looking this down. completes Where the gymnastic my portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Right Please there. go stand in front of it. This is art. <laughs> you will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. This game is awesome. Good. Now please return to your bed. Oh, my bed. Okay. <coughs> Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. This is Hello. Hi. In there? Yes, I'm in here. Hello. Where are you? Are you gonna open the door? This door? No. no the door. Ah. This door. Ah. God, oh. God. You Hi. look um good. Looking good actually. Are you okay? How are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Yeah, okay. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh. How? What? Is going to happen? You all right down there? Can yes. Can you hear me? Yes, I can Hello? hear you. What the hell just happened? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now you've been under for quite a lot longer and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> Tom, does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay. Is what that you're doing speed? there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Who? Okay. You know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> he is All awesome. reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? Yes. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Dude, Why? just shut up. Close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But I love space. Uh, just, just got to get through here. This right, reminds me of the Citadel ride in uh, Half-Life 2. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Your fault? Alright, so no, I hear that one. I hear that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone so I wasn't asks, one of those no things. No one's going to ask, don't worry. But if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. 
There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. Okay. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Well, it says docking station. Whoa, dude. Good news. That is not a docking station. Well, so there's one mystery solved. It uh, said I'm docking station. A manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. <laughs> what the hell? A the manual override on the wall? Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Hey. We're through. There we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But, um... At least you're a good jumper, so you got that Yay. jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Oh, I need to go. Okay, bye. What's his name? I thought right. it was Wheatley. Off you go. <coughs> good luck. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to hey, circumstances of the... potentially apocalyptic significance. The one from the control. first. Portal. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These oh, pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Yay! Okay, run, run, run! Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. You have just passed through an Aperture Science Material Emancipation Drill, which vaporizes most Aperture Science equipment that touches it. Yeah. Well, they uh, redesigned everything. The elevator is smaller. But I don't like this loading screen. I like the elevator more. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Hmm. What's this? What does it do? Great portal. Uh. Oh, now I get it. So I need to. No, wait. So I need to get in there. Grab the weighted storage cube. It feels heavier. Or sounds heavier, or whatever. Then press that button. And over there, why did I take the cube with me? And now to press this button. Hi, camera. You following me now? Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An nope. Aperture Science Reintegration <coughs> Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Another loading screen? If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to, or is incapable of listening to reason. Animal king take over. the hell? <laughs> Great animal king. I want the portal gun. This is boring. Hey, hey you oh. made it! Where are you? Hey! There should hey. be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Ah. I can't see it though. Oh. Oops. Hello? Hi. Can Where? you see the portal gun? <laughs> no. Also, are you alive? That's important. Should have asked that first. 
I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go okay. Team. Sounds like a plan. I'll see you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. Who built this? Another test subject. Uh, is it going over here? Yes. <coughs> uh, I can only shoot one portal. Oh, it doesn't shoot uh, uh, a blue orb or whatever. It just creates a portal instantaneously. Okay, I'm, run, I'm going to run through the glass. Oh, I can't. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. <laughs> well, that's yeah. a reassuring If you feel thought. that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. It just makes no sense at all. But that's what's great about the Portal games. <coughs> but I want GLaDOS back. After all, she's still alive. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death. Smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Awesome. Why is this test so dangerous? Or did they enhance the truth? Ah, uh, these are the old ah uh, well it's actually quite uh, uh, fun these old uh, levels it's Great actually, uh, like a tutorial this but it's all recorded going to any help. observations related to your performance are speculation on our part please disregard any undeserved compliments <laughs> ah stupid glass in here. Uh, what's the blue thing? What's that blue thing? I don't want the blue thing. Go away. <coughs> if the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Uh, 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 where am I? Uh, okay. That was weird. For some reason I thought I was on the ceiling or on a wall or whatever. Okay. Oh, that blue thing is uh, where the portal is. Okay. Oh, the sludge or whatever. So, I need to activate... This. So he will drop... One, and then I can shoot a portal. 